हेलो एवरीवन टुडे आई विल एक्सप्लेन एक्सरसाइज 2.2 फॉर क्लास टेंथ फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन देर आर सिक्स पार्ट टुडे आई विल एक्सप्लेन थ्री पार्ट एंड नेक्स्ट थ्री पार्ट वी विल एक्सप्लेन इन नेक्स्ट वीडियो सो लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल क्वेश्चन नंबर वन फाइंड द जीरो फॉलोइंग क्वाड्रेटिक पोलिनोमियल डू यू नो द मीनिंग ऑफ क्वाड्रेटिक द डिग्री ऑफ पोलिनोमियल इज टू दैट इज कार्ड क्वाड्रेटिक and verify the relationship between the zeros and the coefficient first we will solve this and then we verify the relation of zeros and coefficient x here minus 2x and minus 8 we will factorize it by using split the middle term you have to take two numbers such that if we add we get minus 2 but when we multiply we will get minus 8 you know that 4 and 2 4 you have to take minus and 2 you have to take positive this middle term we will split x square minus 4x plus 2x minus 8 these two pair Take x as a common, x minus four. Take two as a common. Internal x minus four will left. X minus four here, and x minus four here also common. Take x minus four outside, and internal x plus two will left. There are two zeros of this polynomial. Either x minus four equal to zero. That implies x equal to four, or x plus two is equal to zero means x equal to minus two. We have two zero, four and minus two. Now we have to verify the relationship between the zero and coefficient. Relationship is sum of zero. Now we have two zero. And alpha plus beta means sum of zero. First zero is alpha, second is beta. Sum of zero. According to formula, minus coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x here. But if you see from here, if we do the sum of zero, four plus minus two, sum of zero gives us two. Now, according to this formula, coefficient of x. See here, what is the coefficient of x? Minus two and minus sign is there, so you will write minus minus two and coefficient of x here divided. Coefficient of x here is nothing, means one by one minus and minus plus sum of zero. According to our factorize, there is two. And according to coefficient and zero formula, it is two. Now product of zero. Product will four multiply minus two coming minus eight. And here constant term. This is a constant term. We write here constant term minus eight. And coefficient of x here is one. This is coming minus eight. Verified. And in simple way, you learn this formula: minus b by a, and this as c by a. The coefficient of x is a, coefficient x here is a, coefficient of x is b, and constant term as c. Now, statement of second part: four x here minus four x plus one. You have to think about number. When we add two number, we get minus four, and then we multiply. Previous this sum there was coefficient one, so one multiply minus eight was minus eight. Here coefficient is four, so you have to multiply this and this. Four multiply one, so multiply when we do it should come four. So you think about number, it will be minus two and minus two, minus two and minus two you will add minus four, and minus two and minus two you multiply it gives plus four. Split the middle term. 4x here, minus 2x, 
minus 2x plus 1. Make pairs. 2x take common. 2x minus 1. Take minus 1 as a common. 2x minus 1. Minus we have taken as common. Internal sign will be changed. Now 2x minus 1 and 2x minus 1 common to both. Take 2x minus 1 outside and internal 2x minus 1. Either you can say 2x minus 1 whole square. 2x minus 1 is 0. Means 2x equal to 1. x equal to 1 by 2. It is our first 0. Now either this 0 or either this 0. 2x minus 1 equal to 0. It gives x equal to 1 by 2. Now sum of 0. Sum of 0. If we do sum of 0. 1 by 2. Plus 1 by 2, which give us 2 by 2 means 1. Sum of 0 is 1. Now, according to this formula of relationship between zeros and coefficient, formula is coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x square, or either you can learn as b by a. What is our b? Minus 4. Here previously I removed. Minus. Minus 4. And coefficient of x here is 4. Minus and minus plus 4. 4 by 4 is equal to 1. You can check. Sum of 0 according to this. Split the middle term by factorization is coming 1. And relationship formula is coming 1. Now we will do product of 0. 1 by 2. Multiply 1 by 2 which give us 1 by 4 means C by A. It is C by A. This is C and this is A. Now C is 1 and our A is 4. 1 by 4. Verify it. Now third 6x square minus 3 minus 7x. Previous, previously I have told you first you arrange in descending order, first we write 6x square minus 7x minus 3. Now split the middle term. We have to think about two number. When we add, it gives minus 7. By adding, give minus 7. And by multiply, 6 multiply minus 3 minus 18. Two number, have you thought? Okay. Two numbers are minus 9x plus 2x. This middle term we split as minus 9x plus 2x minus 3. Now make this pair. Always write equal sign. 3x take common. 2x minus 3. Take here 1 as a common. 2x minus 3. Now 2x minus 3. And 2x minus 3 is common. Take 2x minus 3 as outside. 2x minus 3. And internally 3x plus 1 will be left. First 0 and this is a second 0. Either 2x minus 3 equal to 0. Means 2x equal to 3. x equal to 3 by 2. First 0. Now if 3x plus 1 is 0. So you can write 3x equal to minus 1, x equal to minus 1 by 3. Now we will do the sum of 0. Sum of 0, if you do 3 by 2 plus minus 1 by 3. Take LCM as a 6. 2, 3 is a 6, 3, 3 is a 9. And 3, 2 is a 6, minus 2, it, it will be. 7 by 6. Product. Product will be 3 by 2 multiply minus 1 by 3. 3 and 3 will be cancelled and it will be minus 1 by 2. Now we will verify by formula b by a. b by a is coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x here. Coefficient of x is minus 7. One minus sign will come which according to formula this is a minus sign. Write minus, minus 7 
and coefficient of x is 6. Minus and minus will be cancelled 7 by 6. Check. It is a 7 by 6 according to solving that and according to formula 7 by 6. Now product of 0. Minus 1 by 2 coming and according to this formula constant term. Constant term is minus 3. Write minus 3 and coefficient of x here is 6. Divide by 6. Minus 1 by 2 check here. 1 by 2. These two zero when we do product is coming and by this relationship formula between zeros and coefficient it is coming minus 1 by 2 verify. This question has six parts. Three parts I have explained and another three parts I will explain in next video. Hope you will understood. Thank you.